It's Paul Potts. <laughs> what are you here for today, Paul? To sing opera. You work at Carphone Warehouse, <laughs> and you did that. You've made it through to the semi-finals. My voice has always been my best friend. If I was having problems with bullies at school, I always had my voice to fall back on. I don't really know why people bullied me. I was always a little bit different. So I think that's the reason sometimes that I struggle with self-confidence. When I'm singing, I don't have that problem. I'm in the place where I should be. All my life, I've, I've felt insignificant. But after that first audition, I realised that I am somebody. I'm Paul Potts. So, seven acts down. We still have one to go. The final act of the evening. Ladies and gentlemen, give them a big hand. It's Paul Potts! of the night and the voting lines are now open. So get voting. Good. Paul, how was that for you? Like jelly. <laughs> like jelly? <laughs> and since your show went out on TV earlier in the week, what's, what's the response been like from the public? Oh, it's just been... It's been like a... It's like I'm on a, on a roller coaster ride, really. It's like on a, on a bus. I, I just don't want to get off that bus. I don't want that stop. That bus is still going to get off. Well, the judges loved you last time. He doesn't want to get off this bus that's on a roller coaster. What do you think of him now? <laughs> very, very, very few things leave me speechless. You're one of them, Paul, I can tell you. Um, when, I, when, I, when, I, when I signed up to do this show, uh, I remember talking to Simon, and we both shared this sort of vision of finding somebody who was doing an ordinary job, very unassuming, quietly had an amazing talent, and we could provide them with the platform to just show the world what they could do. And you're that guy. You, um, you've managed to make me cry again. 
<laughs> um, I've turned into a wreck again, and I don't want to be dramatic, and I'm not trying to get any kind of sob story here, but my granddad passed away this week, and he would have voted for you, so I vote for you on behalf of him. You were fantastic. <laughs> Oh, you know, I don't know what it is about you, but I just, every time you come on, I want you to do well. And you just did again. It was magic. Thank you, judges. Well, you, I mean, dedicated to a black... Fantastic comments. Please. What do you say about that? I feel like I'm still dreaming. <laughs> <laughs> Well, well if, done. if you want to see Paul in the Britain's Got Talent final, the lines have just opened. The number of callers on there is one thirty-two twenty-two oh eight. Ladies and gentlemen, Paul Potts.